Hi guys! So, today is Friday. I got home from Glasgow on Monday evening and came home to a flat battery in my car. So, um, yeah, so I went to teach Tuesday evening at my local yarn shop and she had to come pick me up <laughs> because I couldn't start the car. Um, and then once we'd finished, her husband brought me back to see if he could jump it. And we used every little battery that was in this power bank thing that he could use to um, jump start the car. So it did work. I immediately put my foot on the gas, um, on the accelerator, and held it. So drove it back to theirs because they have a charging unit in their garage. And we left it on charge overnight. Um, and then I was back at the shop for about 10 o'clock on Wednesday morning. And I spent all day at the shop. Mainly because my car was on charge. So it couldn't go anywhere. Um, but also we had Nittanata from 1 till 4. The shop is open from 1 till 6. And then we were teaching again from half 6 until half 8. Don't think I actually left though until about half past 10. <laughs> um, but what I have been doing is just crocheting because that's what I enjoy doing I have tried to tidy up a little bit at home there is still so much that needs doing um, I have managed to move my dentist appointment as well so that I can go up to Glasgow again in October half term for a few days um, and it means I get to go to the Glasgow School of Yarn show which is up there which will be really nice to go somewhere different and yeah i've just been trying to relax and get stuff done so my main aim at the moment is that i'm trying to get the ho 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 blanket done and as of this morning i have four rounds left of the back border and then i need to do the joining round for the two borders so i have five rounds left and I've just timed how long it takes me to do one long edge. And it's about 15 minutes or so. So each round is taking me almost an hour to do. Um, but that's okay. I've got, like I said, I've got literally five left to do. So I'm hoping I can get that done tonight. Um, yeah, I'm heading to the shop. Literally should be there now. Um, we're going to do a little bit of stock take on the style craft that we have and just tidy up a little bit just um, ready for tomorrow and then I'm going to come back I've got to take Joey to my parents house because he's dog sitting for them over the weekend um, he's currently out dog sitting now but I've just had a message to say he's on his way back so I need to get out of here quick um, yeah so not an awful lot going on. Um, I don't know if I if I mentioned before that we had an ele electrician come round and I knew that I had an extension lead plugged into a plug socket, still turned on, but the extension lead no longer worked because it had blown um, and I couldn't get to it. So when the electrician came round, I managed to get to it and unplug it. However, couldn't actually get the other end and pull it out because the plug won't go behind the unit and I couldn't get any pulling on it um it basically needed one person at one end to keep it flat one person at the other end to pull so I've managed to do that though it meant having to move the sofa that I'm currently sat on because it was down here um yeah so between me and Joey we've managed to do that I now just need to start the very long task of trying to sort everything out and put everything back together where it should be. Which, if you know me, takes quite a long time. Because I have a lot of stuff. But, yes, I have been working on the Ho Ho Ho. That is almost done. So, that is my main priority. I have a snowman that I need to finish that I started on my way home from Glasgow. It needs a hat a scarf and arms I think that's all it needs um yeah so that'll be next on my list once I finish the ho 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 
and then I'm moving on to the Lucky Puppy because I can border that. I can I can probably do three rounds front and back border, so that should be quicker. Um, but it might not be because it. I'm going to do that with trebles. I think. I don't know. Might do it half trebles. We'll see. Um, yeah, I am literally up to date on all of the podcasts that I watch. Um, I might. Um, I'm also up to date with Critical Role. My phone did send me a notification very early this morning, about 3am, to say that um, they were live on YouTube and obviously streaming on Twitch. So that would be this week's episode, but that won't go up on YouTube properly for a few more days. So, yeah, I'm up to date with what is already on YouTube. Um... So I might put on, actually, when I get home later, I might put Knitting Traditions podcast on, um, who is Inga in, I think, Norway, um, because she's got quite a few episodes now, and I was up to date last year. I am nowhere near up to date now, so I, I've been trying to work my way through those, but they are quite long, So, and she's got such a soft voice that I like to put her on in the background because yeah it's quite calming so I might do that this afternoon whilst I'm trying to finish the ho 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 but yeah so the next time I see you I will show you the finished ho 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 um so it'd be like a little sneak peek for you because otherwise you wouldn't see it finished until podcast at the end of the month um the other thing i need to do today is edit the podcast from july so i have all the video done i've got all the photos now um yeah i need to sit down and edit that hopefully it won't take me too long because yeah i managed to do it all in one go when i was in glasgow so that is on my list and then obviously over the weekend i am teaching on saturday in the morning and then the shop is open till four so I'll be there and when I come back home I will be working on getting my Glasgow vlog put together and get that ready for the channel as well so that's it from me for now I will see you all again later I am now heading to the shop It's Saturday, I've been at the shop all day and I've been trying to finish my ho-ho-ho blanket and I have just sewn in the last two ends of the border so it's finished so it's got holly berries in the corners I did notice that I'd missed some stitches in the back border but I was not ripping it all back because what you do is you carry the yarn up when you change rounds so <laughs> yeah but it's done and I am very happy with it I just need to get some decent photos now for it and then yeah that's one thing off of my big whip list um next up I have some polar bears to make, I have some pandas to make, um, I want to make a giant strawberry, not really sure why, but I'm going to make a giant strawberry. Um, so Ali of Starry Eyes Ali and a little, the Little Drops of Wonderful um, is hosting a strawberry shortcake along and basically anything fruity foody goes. <laughs> as long as you can link it to strawberry shortcake in some way so um 
I think she posted on her last podcast about it that um, she added some links in there for some patterns that she'd found. Um, so I'm going to make a giant strawberry. <laughs> Um, and I'm going to use Yummy Yarn. I don't have it behind me because it's in front of me in a bag. Um, but yes, so I finished one blanket. Um, I also have a snowman that needs a hat and some arms. And I have the lucky puppy that I want to border, which is sitting over here. Um, but I'm going to have a break from bordering. Do something a bit different so I might do the strawberry first and then yeah I've got I mean the other things that I'm doing kind of have deadlines so ideally I should be doing those particularly the polar bears because they've been asked of me um yeah so actually I might might send to a polar bear first <laughs> and see how that goes because there are two sizes there's a baby bear and a mummy bear so yeah and the mom, the baby bear is the first one so at least then i can see how big it's going to be and get an idea of how long it's going to take me to do the bigger one um yeah so it is saturday um joey is not home for the weekend my parents have gone um to see family in oxford so i'm home alone i have just had pizza for dinner i literally got in at something like 10 to 6 and immediately went and put food in the oven because I was hungry so I've had half a pizza I've got another half left um, so I might snack on that later otherwise I'll keep it for tomorrow um, but yeah I also need to start tidying up a little bit because it's not got any better um, yeah so <clears throat> I'm going to put I wanted to get this done first before I even put the TV on because I didn't want any distractions and I only had one long side left to do when I got home so yeah that is done I'm very very pleased with it I'll give you more details in August's podcasts um podcasts podcast um but if you want more details before then um head back to previous podcasts because it is on there um but yeah it's done Hehehe <laughs>